if we think about sydney we can visualize the opera house in our mind automatically that is amazing no doubt but there is a lot more in sydney to enjoy high rise modern city day to night life water riding beside the harbor bridge and so many so welcome to the butter and butterfly show and here i am hi guys i'm just uh, pretty much pretty much excited because i'm headed to uh, headed to the west and my wife is uh, i believe headed to the uh, headed to the east yes i was so excited because i'm leaving dhaka and i'm off to sydney a very happening city this is actually dhaka airport and looks so quiet because of the covid hit but still i'm excited to uh, she was going to her hometown and i'm going just out of the country oh my god i'm just so excited uh and it, it, it would be fun i believe and uh, which country i'm just going i don't want to share with you right now because this could be a mystery see i didn't even want to tell you where i'm going wow my first experience in dhaka was fully loaded traffic because it was the office time i was headed to the airport and probably it was my last homemade f food for a couple of days wait uh, i'm just going to enjoy it this is a homemade solid burger my wife gave it to me and wait for that thank you so much honestly the airport area was so quiet but good for me as i am not going to have a big queue that's cool but after the boarding pass the area was real cool i love the most of the places where so uh, i mean those were so clean because there were not so much uh, not so many people and obviously followed by a super nice journey by malaysian airlines and then an awesome transit in kuala lumpur so i am gonna have a big day and night with all the way long journey the dhaka airport experience was like there was there were less people but everything was lively it was not a feeling like i'm going to make a journey through a very alone place and i'm not comfortable it's not happening to be honest it's cool i liked it take off was on time and the weather was fresh sunny but the sky of dhaka was not that clear but it was good while i was moving over thailand and uh, but it was superb when i was in the sky of nsw i mean i was about to sydney okay after leaving dhaka malaysia airlines served a dish as a lunch the taste was good got a portion of rice chicken curry and vegetables as a meal followed by a very tasty slice of chocolate cake as a dessert and the fruit salad and i love the bread and butter the tiny bottle of water was looking so cute and i like the taste of both apply uh, i mean both apple and orange juice you know it was it was a very fantastic experience at the time of landing to kuala lumpur international airport because if you look or clearly the two planes were landing at the same time i did enjoy that so much it was a nice evening coming in malaysia the weather was dry and little windy Cool, I like that as well. Welcome to Malaysia. Hi there, I've uh, just arrived in the Kuala Lumpur International Airport. Just, um, uh, just let's see, this is amazing. This is a very, uh, very colorful. You know, those are just lights. And just the KL Airport was really big and huge to walk. It's uh, totally colorful and I loved walking and see everybody is busy walking. That's cool. I love the train. If you are there, for example, there are two airports in Kuala Lumpur and you can travel one to another by train. Uh, but this train completely free. That's awesome. Before leave yourself for the train, please make sure about your next terminal. I loved all the shops and the collections were, uh, I mean, definitely those were gorgeous and so far I understood from my research over here and in internet, you gonna pay a little extra here, man. That's true. All the best, it's time for dinner and I'm gonna catch Burger King where it is. All the food courts are on the second floor and here is my favorite Burger King but it was not like Dhaka, Malaysian people like more dry so you know. You need to enjoy that. Not bad. Landing in Sydney was so excited for me because uh, for the first time I'm landing in Australia. The weather was so fresh and cloudy. I can sense it. 
and after leaving the Sydney International Airport it was very easy to catch the taxi you need you just need to walk over to the stop Uber is also available if you have the internet weather is so fresh and cool in Sydney temperature is 31 but so windy even you're gonna need a hoodie as well fantastic finally I'm in Australia thank you so much for watching see you in the next video and don't forget to subscribe and hit the like button I believe you like the video apart from YouTube we are regularly making our travel post to our Instagrams and Facebook you will find the links on the description down below happy travel